HMA. Pro VPN Guide, let websites and IPS bypass the VPN using static routing. There are several reasons for letting certain IPS or websites bypass the VPN connection, so they are used with your real IP and connection instead. For example, if a certain website is blocking access to foreign IPS, so you can only access it with your real IP. If websites and services forbid the use of VPN, so your account won't get restricted or suspended. If you cannot access a local machine in your network while the VPN is connected, e.g. server, other computer, or network device of any kind. 1. Windows, Manual Setup via root.exe On Windows, to create static routing rules to let IPS bypass the VPN, you need to use the integrated tool root.exe of Windows. You can find it in the folder c colon backslash windows backslash system 32, but it's executable from any place. To use it, open a command prompt. Run command exe or navigate to all program slash accessories slash command prompt in the start menu. Run root to get the instructions for how to use this tool. How to use it for our purpose, IPS bypassing the VPN, is quickly explained. First you need to find your gateway IP address. This is usually the IP of your router slash DSL modem, so the device your computer gets the internet from. If you're not sure which IP that is, please run root print. In the midsection of the output, you should see something like this, you'll see that certain IPS are using a gateway address that belongs into your local network. In this case, 192.168.88.2 is HMA's gateway IP address, the IP of the router. Keep that gateway IP address in mind. Now we need to get the IP of the website you want to bypass the VPN. For testing, we can use http colon slash slash ipaddress.com. As you might know, this website shows your current IP and location. When disconnected from the VPN, go there and you'll see your real IP and location. To get the IP of that website, you can simply ping it by running pingipadress.com. It returns the IP address, which is 80.237.246.185. Alternatively use websites like http colon slash slash www.hcidata.info slash host2ip.htm for this purpose. Now we create a routing rule for this website by running root at 80.237.246.185192.168.88.2, syntax, root at destination IP gateway IP. When that is done, connect to the VPN and visit http colon slash slash IP address.com. Again, you'll notice that it still shows your real IP and location, instead the VPN IP and location. That means the routing rule is working and the website is bypassing the VPN. Note, these rules are only temporary, that means they disappear upon next system reboot. To make them permanent, use the switch P, so e.g. root P at 80.237.246.185192.168.88.2. 2. Mac OS X, manual setup using root and netstat. The setup is pretty similar to the manual setup with root.exe in Windows, just the commands differ a little. To get the current routing table, so you can see all existing rules and get your gateway IP, run, netstat r. The output should look like the one on the right. You can see that the gateway in this example is 192.168.132.2. Okay. let's create the routing rule. In this example we also want to let ipaddress.com bypass the VPN, so we need to get the IP of that website by pinging it. Run ping ipaddress.com. It returns the IP of that website, which is 80.237.246.185. Run sudo NV at 80.237.246.185192.168.132.2. The syntax is pseudo root NV at destination IP gateway IP. The output should look like in the image on the right. Now, connect to the VPN and visit http colon slash slash IP address.com. You'll notice that it shows your real IP.
and location, instead of the VPN ones. That means the routing rule is working and the IP slash website is successfully bypassing the VPN. 3. Linux. How to creating routing rules on Linux differs from distribution to distribution. For an overview and a detailed explanation for each distribution, see this link, http colon slash slash bit dot ly slash 2 coso lm. Note, the command IP root show shows your current routing rules. 4. Android. To set up static routing rules on Android, your device needs to be rooted. Then you can use any terminal emulator, e.g. this one http colon slash slash bit dot ly slash 2 rod p1b, to get into the command prompt. To get root privileges in the command prompt, so. To show the current routing rules, IP root. To set routing rules, you can use the same instructions as for Linux. See the link http colon slash slash bit dot ly slash 2 coso lm. Above. 5. Using VPN for certain website slash IPS only. The counterpart for this article is to using the VPN for certain website slash IPS only, while everything else is supposed to use your standard internet connection. How this is done is explained here, using VPN for specific website slash IPS only, later.